Hey everyone! Welcome to Sonic Station, and today we have a brand new video that I was not expecting to do. In fact, today's video was something that I was kind of surprised when I found out. So, for those that don't know, yesterday there was a Christmas DLC that came out for Sonic Superstars. In fact, if you want to see it in action, you can check out my latest video, link in the description down below. And what happened was, while I was asleep, uh, there was a new update for Sonic Superstars. And to be fair, a pretty big one. So I decided to take a look at the files this morning. But I was totally wrong, I did not need to do that to see that the internet was going crazy. Because there was a the hedgehog, baby. in the game files. So what does this mean? Does it mean that we are going to have a classic Shadow playable in Sonic Superstars? Does it mean that Shadow is finally going to be part of the cast? What does it mean, Station? Well, with my Sonic Superstars knowledge, I will explain to you all what this means. But before we continue, let me just address this pretty quickly. No, Shadow is not going to be a playable character in Sonic Superstars. We are going to have Shadow in the game, but in an unexpected way, so let me explain to you all. But before we do that, if you guys can and want to support the channel, you already know, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, share with your friends, and all those other things that other YouTubers ask. And without further ado, let's address the issue or the situation with Shadow the Hedgehog being part of Sonic Superstars. So. There is, in fact, a mention to Shadow the Hedgehog in the files, but according to the way that the files are structured, just like I found out that there was a holiday sheer suit for Sonic, we can see that Shadow is actually a costume for Sonic, and you can see that in the general files, because the name for it is shadow Son, which means that Shadow is the costume for Sonic. So, does this mean that um, Shadow the Hedgehog is going to be just a playable character, just like Fields the Rabbit or Max the Rabbit is for Sonic the Hedgehog? Well, actually no, and it doesn't matter what anyone says to you on the internet, I know that there are some people who did not have the right information or are omitting it to get a little bit more of views, you know how things are. But I will explain to you all the truth. If we go to another file that actually shows the list of costumes and DLC that are going to come out with the name that they are featured in the game, we can see that we have um, the designation of Shadow, Kigurim, Kigurumi, Kigurumi, sorry, it's a pretty messed up term for me to explain, Sonic. And what does this mean? A Kigurumi is actually a kind of costume or a pajama where you use a hoodie and a large shirt. Um, you know, um, it's a bit it's a bit hard for me to explain since I cannot explain it properly. So I'll put an image here. See, this is a Kigurumi, and um, we are going to have a shadow Kigurumi for Sonic. So, for those that were thinking that we are going to have classic Shadow playable in Sonic Superstars, no, it's, it's not what's going to happen. We are just going to have Sonic wearing a Shadow costume. In fact, I think that the closest way that I can showcase that is with this image of Sonic Forces. For those that don't remember, back in the day we had a Shadow costume for our avatar in Sonic Forces, and what we are going to get is something a bit similar. It's a Shadow costume for our classic Sonic. But hey, there is more information about DLC, just like uh, changes to the animals for the game. It's a new section for the DLC. We are going to have um, a new cross-promotion with 
Ehub. I have no idea what that is, but that's going to be a Naomi costume. And it seems like we are going to have some kind of waitress outfit. I don't know who Annie is, um, but hey, we are going to need to wait a little bit more to see exactly what it is and how things are going to turn out. But hey, for those that were thinking, we are going to have classic Shadow in Sonic the Hedgehog and that is going to break the lore. Don't worry guys, that's not going to happen. We are just going to have classic Sonic wearing a Shadow costume and I think that this can be a pretty cool cross promotion since Sonic Movie 3 is going to come out and we know that Shadow is there. What did you guys think? Did you guys enjoy the video and this new style of content? If you did, don't forget to leave a like, share with your friends, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care guys! Bye!